My Radar, a powerful weather app for mobile devices. Starting the My Radar app will immediately open the map and radar information of your current location. To navigate the map, simply drag your finger across the screen while using two fingers to zoom in or out. At any point, hit the current location button to get back to your position on the map. There are three different map types you can choose from. In addition to gray, you can also select roads or aerial views. The Layers button provides several ways to customize the data being displayed. For the fastest radar information, we gave you the classic radar. If you need the highest resolution possible, change this to HD radar. In addition, you can also select an overall temperature map. Turn on the temperatures layer to see what the temperatures are like in your area. Rectangles represent water temperatures and ovals represent air temperatures. Select the settings button to change between Celsius and Fahrenheit. The clouds layer can be activated to display cloud data. Within the cloud settings menu, select different cloud type layers such as water vapor. Turn on the warnings layer to display all active weather warnings throughout a region. Tap on a warning to pull up additional details about a specific weather event. Selecting the photos layer will show photos on the map that are based on location. Tapping a photo will allow you to view the image. If you like the photo, you can click the like button and comment on it. You can also browse the photo gallery. Here you can sort the photos by new photos, popular photos that other people have liked, my photos, and nearby photos. The aviation layer displays color-coded alerts called airmets and sigmets. These show areas designated as weather concerns for pilots. By tapping on these, you can pull up specific information for these alerts. Flight plan is a useful feature that allows pilots to enter a flight ID, which then displays your route of flight, giving you the ability to anticipate weather events along your route. With the larger screen of the iPad, we were able to add more capabilities into the weather forecast feature. Select the sidebar button to pull up today's current conditions and temperature, along with the hourly and five-day forecast. Below, you will find additional details about today's weather. Tap on the Change View button to switch between images displayed in the main panel. Slide your finger up to get the forecast details. You can also swap the view to go back to the main radar display. The forecast feature on the iPhone works just a little differently. Activate the forecast in the Layers menu. This time it brings the current conditions and temperatures to the top of the screen, and slide down for additional weather details. On either device, you can save your favorite locations. Tap the star button when you are viewing an area of interest. Once you've saved more than one location, you can easily swipe between them. Take screenshots and share them through email or Facebook. Register to take photos of weather events and share them to the My Radar Photos Map and Gallery. Download it, check it out, and be prepared for any weather.